A news alert tonight, a whooping cough epidemic. It's official tonight after a rash of cases in the last few weeks. 7 News reporter Jacqueline Allen live at the State Health Department. Jacqueline, doctors there are worried this epidemic is about to get even worse. That's right. Doctors here are concerned about what they're calling an epidemic. For a lot of adults, whooping cough or pertussis may seem just like a cold, but in some cases it can be deadly, especially for infants. <laughs> The sound of whooping cough. Something no parent wants to hear. But despite public service announcements by the governor. When our son was an infant, he spent two nights in the hospital after being exposed to pertussis or whooping cough. And even Jennifer Lopez. Pertussis is most often spread by parents. Headlines all over Colorado hint at the disturbing trend. Seven News covered cases at schools in Greeley and Longmont. Longmont High School is warning parents to watch out for whooping cough. For the last five years, Colorado averaged 158 whooping cough cases between January and August. But in the same time period this year, that number shot up to 715. I think that is a lot. Dr. Yes, Wendy Bamberg with the State Health Department says it's normal to see increases in pertussis every three to five years, and we're overdue for a spike. But Four this is different. We usually see those increases when kids go back to school. This year it's a little bit early, so we're concerned that those numbers are going to continue to increase as the school year begins. <laughs> And as this YouTube video shows, infants are the most vulnerable. The reason doctors, politicians, and celebrities alike are now asking everyone to get vaccinated. What would you do if your baby caught this from you? And again, these vaccinations are not just for children. Doctors here tell me they recommend anyone who has contact with infants needs to get the Tdap vaccine. We put all the information about who needs to get vaccinated and the symptoms on our website, thedenverchannel.com. Live in Denver, Jacqueline Allen, 7 News.